Late nights in Louisville are here to stay. City leaders are pulling back a new rule that would have stopped alcohol sales at 2 a.m. instead of 4. After criticism from local bars, they say they have a new plan for safety. Grace McKenna is live in Nulu to fill us in. And Grace, why were bars so against this original plan? Well, Haley, bar owners tell me it's not that they don't want safety. They just want people to understand that when you or I go out at night, the people serving us need a place to go to, and that's often after 2 a.m. This banner outside of Taj spells it out. We're the people that serve all the people that work nine to five. Bars want the lights on and the drinks pouring. Please don't do this. Oppose this ordinance. Let's talk about doing something else. At a press conference Thursday, Metro Council's Cassie Chambers Armstrong backed down from an ordinance she proposed that would stop liquor sales at 2 a.m. What is not a part of the plan at this moment is any change, even a temporary one, to the current liquor license hours. Instead, she's rolling out a new plan after a resounding call from bar owners saying they need the business and second shift folks need happy hour too. Honestly, one to four is where we make our, our most amount of money. And like I said, it generally is a lot of service industry people. Chambers Armstrong says the new plan is a comprehensive safety push after rising violence in her own Highlands district. The plan would roll out safety trainings for bars, a work group with owners to develop best practices. We all share the same goal, ensuring a vibrant, thriving nightlife while also making sure that people can enjoy that nightlife safely. Then the biggest investment, nearly $400,000 to fund three new ABC officers paid for with American Rescue Plan cash. This is sort of a non-police way to engage in public safety. Chambers Armstrong is charging those officers with tracking down what she calls bad actors, the ones bar owners say are causing the issues. If a bar is problematic, then they should be dealt with individually instead of like just grouping all, all us in together. Owners are hopeful the new plan will be a better compromise that allows them to keep serving their own. They are the biggest tippers and they believe in karma and it comes back to you. Open late to rebound from pandemic closures that nearly ran them dry. Chambers Armstrong says that right now Louisville has seven ABC officers. These three new ones would bolster that force in identifying again those bad actors that she said today. She wouldn't name names, but she did say those bars should be on notice in Louisville for WHAS 11 News. I'm Grace McKenna.